What's up guys, this is Trans03, coming to you again with another Transformers Generations Combiner Wars review. And today we're taking a look at the new Transformers Combiner Wars Leader Class Armada Megatron. And there he is in his robot mode, I'm going to do something different this time. He came packaged like this, inside this massive packaging. So, we got a Leader Class Megatron, and first and foremost, I do want to thank a good friend of mine for helping get me this figure. No, it's not Tim this time. His name is Jose. Thank you, dude. You rock. Two thumbs up. He bought me this figure whenever he got his G1-looking Megatron, the Leader Class one, the silver one. He he bought this one for me. He says, dude, you can pay me back next week when you get the money. Dude, he... He, he rocks. Two thumbs up. So, thank you, dude. Two thumbs up. Very awesome figure. So, who knows? I might get that other figure off of you someday. Hmm. But again, what could you do? So, thanks again, Jose, very much. So, now said, he does come packaged like this. With all the accessories. His extra guns and stuff. So, first we're going to set him off to the side. Says gun and his guns and his missile, and you got this massive packaging, very huge. You got a nice picture of Armada Megatron, like I'm gonna kill you. And Armada Megatron, come to the side there. You got Combiner Wars, got our big picture of Megatron, looking all Armada with his big head. Transformers with the black and red Generations line. Some of the same movie packaging. And to the back you got your product shots of Armada Megatron. Go to the bio here. Pause it if you want to read it, folks. Got a nice bot mode picture there. I know mine don't have his shoulders out like that, but I'll show you in the transformation. And he turns into a nice tank representation of himself in Transformers Armada. And we got Sad Child back. Yes. We got Sad Child back. Changes in 15 steps. Launching missile. Ooh. So, nothing really going on here with the packaging. It's just a big leader class packaging. Authentic Transformers on the bottom. That is it for the packaging, folks. So, moving along here, we got Armada Megatron in his robot mode. So all the accessories he comes with comes with two small guns, two purpley guns. They peg together to form another one. This is a little peg in that notch right there. Peg them together. He can hold them. Or there's a port on the side there. You can post post this whole gun assembly in on there so he got two arm cannons so pretty cool do what you want set that gun off to the side and you get a missile the missile loads right up like so and you can fire it the fire mechanism right here just fire it it's if you had the cannon thing situate get locked into place and fire some odd reason the cannon mechanism is not working there it goes gonna give it a little bit of pressure so all that good stuff there um, his cannon is rotatable rotatable you can switch it over here rotate it around without firing the missile into nowhere and you can give him his G1 looking cannon mode just like the other one or just give him the armada look with his cannon on the side and then on the treads you can rotate these up push it forward then untab these bits here and give them his shoulder pads make them more armada looking so, yeah, very cool. So, he does have minicon ports. So, when we get to tank mode, I will show you they actually work. So, he does have a couple of them. Articulation-wise for this figure, his arms can go all the way around. 
his arm joint I really some people just don't like that but eh, it's okay got a nice clicking elbow joint elbow swivel at the elbow can rotate the fists around very nice head sculpt very nice it's on a hinge not a ball joint but he gets some really good range of motion so so same side over here but you got the cannon and uh, feet you can rotate them out nice clicky joint very nice knee joint up the layer like so feet do pivot if you want but the most basically on the transformation joint but they do have some give but really don't and this guy gets hard to stand if you if you get it they do have some guards on the side there so there is our mod of megatron in robot mode now for size comparison why not let's bring in Transformers Generations Starscream with his Minicon Spindle. Okay, there's Deluxe. And why not? Transformers Universe Armada Hotshot. <laughs> why not? And a better comparison for collectors would be Third Party Orion. So, gives you a basic scale wise on this guy. So, very cool. So, all of his gimmicks is awesome. So, he does have an elbow joint on this side, but it limits on that gun, on his shoulder gun. So, arm cannon thing. And, awesome thing is, these tre tread, tank treads are actually rubber, and they actually move. So, very cool. So, enough, enough uh, going on with this figure. Let's get him into transformation. Also, get into the nice silver detail. All Very nice detailed figure. It is very nice. Got two Decepticon logos on his shoulders. Very nice purple. So, very nice purple. You got, like, the Armada Megatron look. So enough said, let's get into transformation. First thing you want to do is rotate these pieces forward on his hands. You know, rotate his hand display. Then close it in. Then you would want to rotate this cannon forward. Pull it in. Straighten up his arm on this side. Keep his head where it is. Just tilt it in. Chest piece will come forward completely. It will cover his head. And then this crotch piece will come down and then you will fold this tank bit up and you'll see this tab here and this slot here there's two of them they slot into the pieces there and we got the top of the tank done first thing next well, next thing there is you break his foot yeah we didn't break his foot it's just a swivel rotate them the foot down like so transformation joint very nice silver like so and then you will come into the side here there are there's a tab here and there's a slot there tab it in there's two tabs you just have to make sure you hit them and we did that side here comes up here and tabs into that skirt same thing on this side here rotate this around break his foot click everything in then this crotch piece you can keep up like this like some people do it kind of gives a better look at the tank but gives us this gap but extra transformation is supposed to peg this in like right there it's kind of hard to do there we go peg it in and we got him in his tank mode yeah his tank mode but this can extend. Watch. And this turret does move. Like so. Very nice clicking motion. And his tank treads do move, if you can see on the camera. 
a little bit of force applied to them. Very cool. And the thing is, this does not tilt. This this cannon does not tilt for like if you want to shoot airplanes out of the sky. Yeah. But again, what could you do, guys? Not the end of the world. Very awesome tank mode. So, very nice molded in detail. Gives you the look of the Armada Megatron. It still got the, the pinchers in the front, which is very cool. Nice Decepticon logo there on the tank. Very nice molded in detail. Very good overall figure. So, very nice. So, for his guns, you can split them in half. There's a post on that side and a post on this side. You can put his guns. Very nice. Now, like I said, the Minicon portholes. Grab Armada Starscreams, Minicon Swindle. You can post them on top of Armada Megatron, which is very cool. So all of them do work. You know, Swindle back here, like, okay, and then you put Swindle up here. So, yeah, very cool. Put Swindle off to the side. <coughs> Excuse me. So there we go, we got Armada Megatron in his tank mode. Very cool. Now for size comparison, let's bring in Transformers Generations Hot Rod. Hot Rodimus. See how they stack up together? He's a tank, car. Car, tank. Enough said. So yeah, very cool. So, you got Armada Megatron. And why not? Let's bring in Transformers Altana Raiders Ricochet. Just for a size comparison vehicle. Altana Raider tank. So, very cool figure. Very cool scale wise on this guy. Set Ricochet back off to the side. So, very cool figure. I highly recommend this figure. He is very cool. So, a lot of nice detail on him. Very nice. Transform him back to robot. Very simple. Split that apart. Very simple transformation. Like so. So, forgive me if this video is longer than usual. I went from robot mode to vehicle to robot. So, some people might like the video. But again, what could you do, guys? What could you do? So, this is TransAaron38 reviewing. The Transformers Armada Megatron. Leader class, anyway. So, this is TransAaron38 talking to you again. Don't forget to check out Prime John Juan. Don't forget to check out Kyle Pigeon 8. Don't forget to check out the gaming PC. Also, Mike Mouse 74 All those links will be down in the description below. Also, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. All that good stuff. So, this is TransAaron38 talking to you again. Have an awesome day.